hi and welcome my name is Daniel and I welcome you back to let's play Octopath Traveler in the last episode we completed Hanit's uh, chapter 4 and right now we are doing Ferion's chapter 4 and yeah excited we won't miss any treasure that's good because treasures always good did I not steal um, okay give me that poem why does that have three percent it's not really something special i think give me that i have so much money i can afford all of that all of that what about those things give me don't know if i have them but give me and yeah um didn't do anything off screen and yeah uh, who are you? Oh, that fever comes back through, uh, though. Take a this twice a day till it's up. It's thank you so much. We're so lucky. Uh, such a good apothecary pass through our village. No need for thanks. It's my job, as all. I'm sir, if I might ask. Was I ever your patient before? So do. Not that I remember, but I move about a lot. I feel like I met you before, long, long ago. Hmm. Could be. Like I said, I move about a lot. I did stay in this village for a time, earning my keep as an apothecary. But when I lost my wife, I felt I left this place. I was on the road for a long time after that. After all these years, though, I guess the fancy just struck me and I thought I'd stop by to see the old place. I'm glad to hear it. Hope you stay with us this time. Forever. And ever and ever. Okay. Didn't expect a cutscene. Melissa. Soon it'll be the anniversary of the day I lost you. Is that why my feet brought me back here? Not like I've got any right to face you again, even if I could. Okay. <laughs> Glad to see some backstory for Ogan, but <laughs> this is kind of Ferion's part right now. <laughs> this is about me, man. So yeah, um, gonna do this some other time. There's an item somewhere around here. Oh, inside the house, right? Uh, later. Uh, where am I going? I need to go to the. I forget that every single time. Well, since we are already here. Uh... Oh, it's Ogan. Steel. Oh. All right. Thirty-six. Nice. I wanted to bring some of my wife's favorite flowers to her grave, but it seems like they don't grow around here anymore. They called mind me always. Okay, doesn't look like I have those. Later. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's start Ferion's quest, chapter four. Now we have to go to a tavern, to the pub. I don't know. Uh, all right. Uh, Ferion, chapter four. You arrived Northreach, a town in Northreach, a town under Darius's control. Say you are determined to retrieve the emerald and gold dragon stones. Yeah, I kind of remember Ferion's story. So yeah, it's not like one of those moments where I'm like, oh, that's what the story was about. <laughs> but okay. The story so far, infiltrating the black market in World Spring in pursuit of the second Dragon Stone, Ferion was reunited with Darius, his erstwhile partner in crime, who swiftly vanished stone in hand. What's with those pitiful minces, so cold and guarded, distrusting and wary? Ferion could not deny what Darius had said. He had sworn to trust no one. He would not betray, not be betrayed again. 
But even as he made his way to Northreach, Cordelia's words wouldn't leave him. Mr. Fearon, I have faith in you. And so it was that he finally arrived at this journey's end. His journey's end. Man, I'm so good. <laughs> so this is Northreach. And it's eager to make a first impression. Stop, those are mine. <laughs> Not anymore, they aren't. And it over. Oh man. Thieves, someone stop them. So to say, but I ain't no one going to stop those thieves. <laughs> Aren't there guards in this town? Hmm. Ain't the guards one layer? And pff, what kind of sense is that? I can't read that. <laughs> That's just our life is here. Best not to get too attached at any. I can't so read those accents. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> but <laughs> he's paradise, huh? Hmm. It's good that I'm a thief too. This Darius, is this Darius is doing? Everyone here is living in fear. Uh, Oi. I just saw something in the background. It's him. <laughs> yeah, no doubt about that. Even, even we are lucky. He's just come to us in the box. What? Yo. Give me a glass of your best. Huh. We're out of our best. Actually, we're out of everything. We're closing for the day. Best you'll be on your way now. Wakata. Guess I'll show myself out. Yeah. Is this me? They didn't even get my best angle. Beware. Any involvement with this man will be considered direct opposition to Lord Darius. Lord Darius? I guess he really does rule this town. I was kind of confused. I thought those two guys would come after me. <laughs> after they saw me on that poster. But I guess they're just civilians. Because I was confused. They just were like, oh, that's him. Let's get him. Then they're like, nah. <laughs> what? Anyway, traveling banter. You sure look like your alehouse, don't you, Virion? I don't go because I like them. I go to hear people talk. Meat and spirits are good for loosening tongues. Hey, so your interest in purely professional. Look, taverns are places where rumors and secrets are spoken and traded. But I wouldn't expect a brat like you to understand. Hey, who are you calling a brat? I've been turning trades and making profits since I was five. Have you now? I delivered spirits to free alehouses every day for over a year. I've seen my share of drunken fools. Should I be impressed? You bet. Still can't stand the smell of grog, though. Makes me gag. Still alright after all, then. <laughs> Come on. I don't like it if there's always a character that gets gets picked on. Cause he or she is a little younger. Right. And there we go. <laughs> you got some guts marching in at this town. Mm -hmm. And you are... Wait, don't tell me. You are Darius' welcoming committee, aren't you? Uh. Aye, and we'll make sure... Get the warmest of welcome, boys. <laughs> I suppose quality over quantity doesn't mean much here. <laughs> Girl, if we stab you enough times, you'll still die. <laughs> You think you can starve for time by your yapping? Ain't nobody coming to save you, even if you're a scream bloody murder. <laughs> you best give up. Uh, you guys go. You best give up up here now. Everyone here fears Lord Darius. <laughs> so what's it like leeching off someone else's power? Shoot it. <laughs> Kill him. <laughs> I just arrived here. Come on. 
Oh yeah, I still have Cyrus in my team. Oh yeah, team Ferion, Apothecary, Overig, Hunter, Cyrus, Dancer, because why not? And Trissa, Cleric. Get that out of the way. Let's kill those guys. Those fools. Mm. Oh, now it's Cyrus's turn. Uh. And in your face. No. Uh. Yes. They actually call this Darius sub one. Okay. Thunder. That was easy. <laughs> Quality over quantity. Blue nail. <laughs> Enough. I've got bigger fish to fry. Enjoy your victory while you can. Because there's no way you're leaving this town alive. Oh, please. More free experience. This is getting old fast. You ready to die, mate? It'll be slow and painful for you, that's for sure. There's nowhere left for you to leg it. I'm starting to see the appeal of quantity over quality. These odds are bad anyway I look at them. Oh, yeah. The look of resignation is unfitting of you. Oh, heave coat. The super butler is here. I don't suppose you could have gotten here any sooner. You can thank me later. For now, follow me. You don't have to tell me twice. After him. Could you at least? Show some emotion of worry or something. <laughs> Sometimes. どうした。息が上がっているぞ。当たり前です。それが老いるということです。若者には想像もつかないでしょうが、老いれば肉体も精神も衰えるのです。<笑> あれにこの腕を<笑> では、それがなぜ、レイバースケの羊をしている。
流石を守ることになる我が子をどうか助けてやってくれとねそれを律儀に守っているということか腕に自信があればあるほどしくじった時の屈辱は大きいものですあなたもそうだったはずです<笑>その通りだこの腕輪を見るたびに思い出すあんたにしてやられたとな私も同じですよ同族家業から足を洗うしかなかった盗み先で情けをかけられたとあっては盗賊の治れですそうかですがあの屋敷で盗賊の誇り以上に大切なことを教わりましたあんたほどの盗賊がその誇り以上のものをええ、人から信じてもらうことそして人を信じることの尊さをそれはあなたも聞いたでしょうお嬢様の過去をああ今のあいつからはとても想像できないこの世のすべてが敵そう思い込み誰も寄せつけようとしなかったですが日々の積み重ねがお嬢様を変えていきました積み重ねええ私を信じてもらうためにお嬢様を信じることを続けたのです裏切られたことで負った心の傷は信じることでしか癒せないのですよそれを知るからこそお嬢様はあなたを信じているのですかつて自分がそうされたようにか<笑>さて昔話はこれぐらいにいたしましょうダリウスという盗賊から奪われた流石を取り戻さねばなりませんそうだな私はもう老いてしまったここからはあなたにお任せいたしますあなたを信じていますよああ任せておけあんたたちの期待は裏切らない行ってくれ<音声>まずダリウスのアジトを見つけ出すきっとどこかに手がかりがあるはずだあんらいてんレベリングベンターいや、you look like you want to say something from the expression on your face it would seem you found your answer my answer maybe I have it is a good thing to set one's mind at ease Is it not invigorating to allow yourself to trust another? Maybe it is. I guess it's never too late to learn something new. Okay, that was a really short conversation. Yeah, I kind of figured that the butler was. I I thought he was some kind of assassin or something. But yeah, a thief that makes sense too. Oh. Well, this is ironic. I'm the most most wanted man here, but I haven't stolen a thing yet. Oi. Any trace of him yet? <laughs> Not yet, sir. <laughs> Vanished like a white wolf in a snowstorm, he did. And you'll be the next one to vanish if you don't、uh, stop your whining. Now, Lord Darius promised a reward for his capture. So, if you ever want to see real witches, you better will find them. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> Now, get back to work.
He sure sounds important. He probably knows the way to the hideout. Okay, let me just check. There are a bunch of weapons that I haven't bought yet. Yeti's longbow. I don't know if I need them, but I want them. Oh, I don't have anything to sell. I need to do something with my money, okay? Yeah. Probably in the cathedral, right? Ophelia doesn't have to go there. So yeah, it has to be important. First, I thought because there was a cathedral that Ophelia had to go there, but then I realized that there are cathedrals like that in, I think, every town, almost every town. I only need to go to the big ones. <laughs> Also, this one looks a little bit destroyed. Oh. The abandoned church. Nothing seems out of order. Yet. Hey. <laughs> Like maybe these stairs. If the hideout isn't there, I don't know where it could be. Were they there before? But I can't just watch through the front door. Time to find myself a disguise. Um, treasure. Steel thieves clothing. You don't seem to have one, right? Come on. You don't happen to have one, right? Okay, I was wondering, do we need to steal something in his path? In his chapter, we didn't have to fight in Hunnit's chapter with Linda, so yeah, that was kind of weird. That's why I thought at the end that we could have fought with the master, but no, that didn't happen either. So yeah. I hope someone finds the bastard soon, else we'll be getting an earful from the boss again. A small fright, this should be easy. Boy. Hey, looking for me? Oh. Damn right I am. Where the hell did the bastard go? What? Uh... Why is he so oh. close to this this other guy? No. Hey, you fiend! No. <laughs> yeah, I trust you won't be missing this. This kind of reminds me to Final Fantasy VI <laughs> when Locke was <laughs> stealing the clothes from this one Imperial guard <laughs> or this merchant first. <laughs> won't be needing this for now. Sleep tight. I wouldn't surprise if this was some kind of reference because this game is from Square Enix, so yeah. There's something else here. Another one. Boy. Hey, looking for me? <laughs> you mine now? Hum dum 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 dum. Uh, where did he go? Damn, I lost him. Hi. I'm gonna assume that this one will be harder to steal. <laughs> All right. <laughs> you won't be needing this for now. Sleep tight. Now I have two. Now I have two disguises. They will not see this coming. <laughs> uh, I just realized that that everyone else looks normal, 
so yeah um you, you guys might give me away please put on some disguises i mean if tressa if i could give tressa the scholar job then yeah she kind of looks like Ferion. <gasps> yeah but okay let me guess that this guys won't do anything right Stealing clothes from a thief that's a new one now to for the lookouts hey bros what's up all it identify yourself hmm. they're just kids maybe they maybe new recruits in that case Emira. just who do you think you're asking me that Sorry, sir. <laughs> you got guts for getting who your leader is. <laughs> Please forgive us. Mm -hmm. Fine. You look. I'm a. I'm a. I'm in a good mood today. <laughs> but Lord Darius, hear about it. It next happens. Get out of my sight. <laughs> Now listen, some fool claim to be might be try and slip in. But don't you dare let that bastard through your area. Uh, yes, sir. Jeez. <laughs> Ferions and his imp impressions. Too easy. I never sneak in through a window again. I better make it quick. It's only a matter of time until I figure out what happened. <laughs> yeah. Oh, On my way. I've got urgent news for the boss. Huh? It's you. You're that phony the leader was talking about. Oi. Phony? My clothes were stolen by that stupid thief. <laughs> no leader of mine would be stupid enough to get his clothes stolen. You bastard. <laughs> ah. <laughs> that was awesome. For an organization, they are really most disorganized. If it makes my job easier, I'll take it. I figured you'd say something like that. Still, they are the factor leader barely exerts any control over the rank and file. And you expect otherwise, they're just a band of thieves. I would posit that there's more than it, just that. For this terrorist, this man of his organizations are little more than tools. He does not consider them comrades, let alone friends. I dare say he trusts no one but himself. You may be right. At any rate, your goal is close at hand, Ferion. Do not waver in your convictions. <laughs> you can count on me. I hope. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> I love it when on first he plays like a drunk merchant or something now now that that is awesome up of revival the first time that I have something like that no no 16 up didn't even move I think all right. Bandit bones. Ah, still not. Still not as good as Davy bones. <laughs> oh yeah. Okay, we should be able, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> Why are those things so weak? No. Oh. Wow, destroyed. Total domination. Uh, I don't have. I just realized. I don't have what I always need. Hail and hearty. Uh, let's go with that. 
and see what's going on in here it's a treasure chest not a purple one but doesn't matter i can open it no matter what color the chest is <laughs> uh here no here let's go over here dun, 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 dun. dead end probably hopefully oh good uh boom. Are we no tracer? Um, lightning. Yes. Oh my god. <laughs> wow. Why is tracer so strong? All of a sudden. I think she wasn't that strong <laughs> last time. Did I do something? I didn't change anything of her stuff. She has 800 elemental attack, but yeah. And she's like, what, 15 levels or more lower than. Cyrus, it's kind of crazy. Okay, this dungeon is straightforward. Me like. Mm -hmm. Purple chest, gleaming amulet. Probably not something important, but yeah. Uh, uh, like damage taken. Yeah. Wonder if I ever have to use those things. If I have to fight against some really strong boss or something. Like use certain attacks, like like magic or something. That I have to resort to. Whipping everyone with light resistance thingies. That's why I usually keep those things. Because you never know. Maybe someday fight against a really strong optional boss. He uses certain attacks and then boom. You don't have protective gear. And yeah. That's why you always keep like one for the whole group and like every RPG. Wow, <laughs> 100 SP back. Uh. I can't believe that some people have a requirement of level 60. For all break like i can only change challenge some people if all break is level 60 like that's kind of crazy i mean and i really hope this game isn't like some other rpgs like i don't know the hardest boss in the game doesn't nearly need level 60 for example and still another purple chest oh enchanted sword yeah but they are outmatched by now i don't know let's just say the strongest boss optional boss or whatever is not nearly level 60 but you need like level 60 to challenge the one guy who is like protecting house and i don't know let's say that person is protecting like 
an ultimate weapon. I mean that that would not make any sense. Like why would I get to level 60 to get that ultimate weapon? The optional boss, the strongest optional boss in the game needs like I don't know. level 50 or something i don't know how to explain that but i hope you know what i mean it's like for example what i'm, I'm a really big fan of the tales of games like tales of uh graces exilia and all that berseria tales of games and what they usually tend to do is you have to like beat the strongest optional boss in the game and then usually after you do that you get to you get like the ultimate weapons of the game i can tell of the abyss there's an there's an optional boss that is ridiculously strong and what they usually do is you get ultimate weapons a little earlier but they are not powerful like they are not unlocked the, the strengths not unlocked they usually are only unlocked after you beat like an optional boss and get something from that or whatever that kind of sucks like yeah i got now the ultimate weapons of the game and i can literally beat anything but there's nothing left to beat like i already proven that i can beat the optional boss without without uh super weapons like that that doesn't make any sense i mean you want to get like some use of your ultimate gear and all that I like the way how Final Fantasy tended that. Like you can get ultimate weapons very early on, but yet to do some pretty ridiculous stuff to get some of them. But if you did that, it was definitely worth it because there were a lot of optional bosses, and the, the super weapons, the ultimate weapons, are kind of like. Yeah, you you need those weapons to actually stand a chance so yeah that is that's the way to do it yeah what I, what I try to get at with this is let's say we have a really powerful optional boss in this game and I don't know uh, say the optional boss is like level 60. Or maybe 80 i don't know and yeah there's a person out there who needs like level 99 to challenge or whatever the max level of this game is maybe on 100 and wait how do i get there over here ah No. What? Like I said, if there, there's an option boss level 80, you beat this person. You don't need to reach level 99. And then you can challenge a person who's level 99 and gives you a really powerful weapon. <laughs> and you're like, EA, I could have used that weapon on the optional boss or something. <laughs> Cannot, I, I don't like it when RPGs do stuff like that. Like, you want to get some use out of your of all the stuff that you get. Of all the of all the things like ultimate weapons and all that. Anyway, let's continue. How do I get that treasure chest? Looks like I have to go from the left. I guess 
By the way, I don't want an answer to that. Like, there are ultimate weapons in this game. I don't want to know when to get them, and of course not where to get them. I just want to point out that if this game does it like that, I also don't want an answer. If that was the case, if the game does it like that. I just want to point out that if it does if it does it like that then I would not appreciate it anyway we're still in this dungeon we try to get this one last treasure chest because kind of looks like as if I'm in front of the boss if I continue this one way after the save point Mm -hmm. I can swear that her magic got a little bit stronger. Maybe I'm just imagining things. I mean, Cyrus is still crazy overpowered, but I can swear that Tressa's magic got strong, and I don't know why. Not that ah, not that I'm complaining at all. Another no, that's a red chest. Refreshing gem. Ah, and, and, mm. curious antique. That's something to sell, right? Uh, yeah. Okay. Great. Now I got. Yes. No. Why? Okay, I can't see a way up there. Ah, ah. I got you. Void amulet. Something that protects me from something there. Dark damage. Didn't have one of those, so yeah, why not? I never like those items that just protect you from one element. <laughs> why would I prefer that to like, I don't know, getting more attack or defense or something? Also, one thing I never really like to do it uh. oh man he's getting off his sp bag that is awesome no uh. uh. oh, what how are you still alive? What? How are you still alive? Okay, um. Uh, uh. I guess we're gonna go into one more battle wait oh I was about to say where am I okay this looks like boost battle let's do one more battle so that if I walk up to this to this green signal I don't get into a battle right before the boss. I really hate it when that happens. That's why I usually do one more battle in front of the save point to like reset the I don't know step counter. Bonk. 
อ๋อเออแอนซิรัสดิสทรอยด์มอลดันเนี่ยโอเออ alright should be fine now Okay, let's save here and heal ourselves up. Heal ourselves up, I said. <gasps> okay, do we have some things to learn? Yes. Do we really get so many? <laughs> um, hunter. I don't know. Wonderbird. Yeah. Patience. Hey, that is actually. A good thing for him, I think. Yeah, still waiting for those, for those last drops. Wait, can I get use of that? And as for one additional turn, why does he have that? That's not like the best thing to have, I think. Let's give him patience. Yeah, some really broken. I'm performing a standard attack. When do I ever do that? Gain 50% counter-attacking, patience, surpassing power. Should I equip that? Mm, yes. With Cyrus as a dancer, so yeah. Fleetfoot. And they have almost identical. Uh, skills, but I kind of do have identical things on most people. Uh, I forgot. Uh, heart and what's it called? Hail and hearty are. Uh. All right. Hopefully, once get one. He will not get one shotted. Okay, that's it for this part. In the next episode, we're gonna, I assume, fight Darius. And yeah, I thank everyone for watching. Please consider leaving a like, a comment, or subscribe. That would be really amazing of you. And I'll see you in the next part. Bye bye.